Larmid's sign, also known as Larmid's phenomenon, also referred to as the Barber chair phenomenon, is the name which describes an electric shock-like sensation that occurs on flexion of the neck. This sensation radiates down the spine, often into the legs, arms, and sometimes to the trunk. Larmid's sign is classified as one of the paroxysmal pain syndromes of multiple sclerosis. Multiple sclerosis is a chronic, predominantly immune-mediated disease of the central nervous system. It is one of the most common causes of neurological disability in young adults globally. Larmid's sign is not a disease. It is a paroxysmal multiple sclerosis-induced neuropathic pain syndrome. It should not be confused with Uthoff phenomenon, another finding in multiple sclerosis patients. The phenomenon is defined by heat sensitivity after prolonged heat exposure, saunas and hot tubs. Etiology It develops as a result of direct or indirect demyelinating lesions in the brain and or spinal cord. Specifically, it activates ascending spinothalamic tracts at the cervical level that have been sensitized by demyelination. This view is supported by an MRI study of plaque formations in the cervical spine, which were present in 95% of those with a history of Larmish sign compared with 52% of those who did not report the sign. Other etiologies besides multiple sclerosis includes tumor progression causing spinal cord compression, radiculopathy, cervical spondylitis, transverse myelitis, subacute combined degeneration of the cord, radiation myelopathy, chemoradiation, among others. It is preferentially present in patients with cervical demyelinating lesions and abnormal nerve conduction studies. It is not a sensitive or specific sign for any of the disorders mentioned. Neck flexion irritates demyelinated tracts in the posterior column, causing the electric sensation experienced by patients. Larmid's sign pathophysiology is related to demyelination of dorsal columns of the cervical spine associated with radiographical demyelinating lesion and electrodiagnostic abnormalities on nerve conduction. It is also associated with compressive myelopathy with reported lesions in the dorsal columns of the caudal medulla. Larmid sign is thought to result from ectopic firing and hyperexcitability of demyelinated sensory neurons in cervical regions of the spinal cord. Neck movements, fatigue, stress and heat can trigger Larmid's sign. Patients often describe Larmid's sign as an electric shock of pain that runs from the head down to the back and through the arms and legs. It happens when they bend their head down and touch their chin to their chest. Evaluation. There is no routine laboratory, radiological or ancillary test to assess or manage Larmid's sign. Some prospective studies linking the sign with radiographic and electrodiagnostic findings. One study showed a correlation between the clinical signs, the presence of a demyelinating lesion on cervical MRI and conduction delay of median and tibial somatosensory evoked potentials. However, the consensus is that the history and physical exam findings are sufficient. This MRI reveals extensive demyelination of the cervical spinal cord and the cervicomedullary junction. Management Usually it is benign and self-resolves. Rarely patients elicit severe pain and discomfort. Carbamazepine, oxcarbazepine, gabapentin may be beneficial in some patients. Interestingly, case series demonstrated that the use of extracranial picotesla ranged pulsed electromagnetic fields effectively treated patients with Lamrich's sign.